Hello, hello, welcome to my channel. I'm Sim Lunacy and today we're continuing with the A to Z baby challenge. Okay, okay, first off, apologies, there is a massive storm happening outside right at this moment and for me it sounds like I'm in a wind tunnel that's made of plastic and the rain's beating on it. It's so loud. Apologize. If there's any weird noises happening around, I'll do my best in editing to try to get rid of them. But oh my gosh, it is raining so hard, which is weird because it's like summer weather here. Oh gosh! Are we giving birth? I think we're giving birth. Oh no, and I haven't picked a name. Oh no! New family member! <laughs> Alright, so the letter Q. And this is the child of Cory. <laughs> Looks like it might be a girl. Brown eyes. Hang on, this new baby has arrived and this bouncing baby needs a name. It's a boy! Okay, that was a surprise. Uh, with Q. Quinton. It's the only Q name I can think of. Okay, there we go. Uh, first off, you need to get... Oh, BJ. Get a bottle for Quinton. And put Quinton in the crib. Parker's busy down here playing with the xylophone. That's fine. We've got a friend over from school. I think that was Madeline's friend. Not 100% sure. Oh, that's right. There was all this food around. Okay, we need to clean this up. Perhaps we should get a... Let's check Parker's needs first. Bladder. Quick. Jay, toilet train. And stop playing with the xylophone. Don't be talked to. You have to be potty trained. No. No. Alright, here comes mum. Mum's... You, carry. There's a whole table full of food you could eat. Oh, this is becoming a habit starting in the middle of the night. All right, training. You can do it. That's one of her aspirations too. Jay, hang in there. How long does this take? Done. Alright. Is Leon available to talk? I don't know. Is he? Um, I don't know, so I'm going to say no. Alright, it's midnight. Have a shower. We can go back to normal speed. Who's up? Ollie. Can you do us a... Oh, dash it all. Yeah, do that. You can't empty the potty, but you can talk to Parker and teach her a nursery rhyme. Hopefully Jay will be able to leave the bathroom and clean all of this up. Clean, clean. I feel like I'm shouting to be heard over the wind. <laughs> what a weird summer day. Alright, let's... Check on everyone else. So Leon wasn't available to talk because he's in bed. Madeline's in bed. Nikki's in bed. The only bad child is Ollie at the moment, although he's making up for it by paying attention to his sister. He does need a bit of fun. It's getting his social up. I mean, he's not losing fun from it. Oh, now he is. 
Alright, you can come play some My Sims when you're done. Jay needs to do some more cleaning. She's not happy with the situation. That's the trouble with Trent coming over and cooking breakfast after all the children have left or while the children are still in the house but just before they leave for school. He fills the table with breakfast and then starts cooking lunch. Kind of makes sense because it does take a while for them to cook and things. Okay, is that making you feel a bit better now? Do you need to empty the potty? And then you can grab some leftovers. And I don't know, maybe if Ollie starts playing the games you can join him. Just grab whatever that is, a hamburger I believe. Ollie, you can you can stop. All right, so he's off to go play his game. When Luna has Luna, that dang nursery rhymes got stuck in my head. Uh, you can join. And Parker, you can come sleep. She's yelling for people that aren't up yet. Everyone's still asleep. Oh, did they do their homework? No, somebody did not do their homework. Nikki. Alright, she's had enough sleep so she can get up and do her homework. Then she can have a quick shower. Everyone else is sort of taking care of themselves. Jay, you're about to go join your son. Oh, and we need to call Nolan over. Call. Never mind. We're going to change diaper. Get a bottle for Quinton. That was short but sweet. Short but sweet. Maybe we just helped Ollie finish that last bit of that level. Gathering golden apples or something. She wants to eat a toaster pastry. Her hunger's not bad enough for that yet, but we'll lock it in. What about Ollie? He wants to eat an omelette. His hunger is going down. Uh, you can put Quinton back in the crib. Use the toilet. And come join your son again. Uh, where did she leave that bottle? Don't know. We'll find it when it starts smelling. Okay. I think we might fast forward through the day until the kids are ready to leave for school. Oh, they should be up soon, so we'll see you in a bit. Okay, everything's happening. It all kind of happened at once. So Trent's ringing for food. We're going to get a whole stack delivered. Hopefully he won't be able to cook. Um, food truck's already arrived. Why is it... We'll just slow it down a bit. Alright, Parker's just skin and bones. Somebody needs to get Parker a bottle. Uh, school bus is going to arrive. Oh, I meant to click that. Um... See ya, kids. Yep, everyone's leaving. Are you going to get your child a bottle or? 
What the? Uh, I know you really wanted a baby that wasn't a baby. Come get a bottle. Oh, I see, because Trent had to put the stuff away. Someone left a bag of chips out. Get a bottle for Parker. Parker, wake up, please. Get ready for your bottle. Crawl here. Oh my gosh, Trent. Don't love the flower sack, baby. Love the baby that you have. Get a bottle for Parker. And then call Nolan. There you go, Parker. Bottle for you. We probably will need to feed Quinton after as well. I just find it so much easier with the letters if I know their name. They look so different in their photos, captures. Come over. Our energy is great. Can my friend come too? No. That would be weird. We're not that desperate yet. Alright, how many days till we age up? 20 days. How come we're having able to have so many more kids than Colleen? Alright, clean that up. Oh, just put this away. Put away as single plates, please. Put this away. And then greet Nolan, who should be arriving. Not ask to leave. Great. Got no mail. You need the potty. Oh, we forgot to feed Quinton. You can go a bit faster, please. What are you going to do? Just, would you greet Nolan or... Okay. Now. Let's potty train... Oh, never mind. Uh, cancel. You're going to change? Change diaper. Nolan's heading to the bedroom. He knows the deal. <laughs> Trent goes, I want to clean that. And now our energy is going down. Oh no. Hurry up. Right, put Parker here. Uh, let's relax. Don't you dare. What does Parker need? She's fine. Ask to join. Oh, that was a cute option. If someone's holding a baby, you can talk to the baby while they're being held by someone else. You like babies, hey? Would you like one of your own? No cutscene this time because it is something that we had tried before. Stupidly with seven sims in the house already. Or eight sims in the house. <laughs> so Parker's gaining some social. We've fallen asleep. That's fine. Is there things Park? I heard the baby music. Alright, so Parker seems to be pretty fine taking care of her own needs. What we might do is go get Leon and move him into a house. Okay, so I completely forget where we put 
um, who's in here? Oh my gosh, who is that? That's Indy. Indy's in there. And we were going to move, oh my gosh, we were going to move Kyle next to Indy. Okay, so that's that one. Right. So Kyle to there. Move to an empty apartment. And who else can, who's going to move out next? Probably Madeline. Or maybe Leon. Nice. Okay. Now, I, I believe Indy's in here. So, is this place free? It looks like it is. So, let's move. Let's rent that one. Oh, I better give him some money. How much does he have? 20. There's Indy. Oh, no, that's Scott. Yes, I want to rent the apartment. That's our landlord. Right, while they're signing their lives away, what's this? You want to get a job in the culinary career? We could do that. Uh, okay, pause. Mother load cheat. There we go. So now let's just uh, decorate. Okay, I did it so basic. There's basically just a bed, a desk. Uh, so he wanted to get a job as a chef, was it? In the culinary career. Is that our postie? Oh, it's Jason. That's Colleen's dad. All right. Let's see if you can get a job. Intelligence. Entertainment. Science. <sighs> Culinary. Right. Well done. So you're taken care of. You can do whatever you want to now. Uh, I guess you could sit here and watch some TV. And um, back to the other household. All right, we've come back with Parker. Still wants to learn how to get potty trained. Oh, I probably should have checked if she needs to go. Not really. Getting a bit sleepy and a little bit hungry. Jay's still asleep and all the kids are still at school. Quinton's also asleep. So there's not really much that we could do. Trent's just wandering around the house cleaning up. Even he's lost at what to do. There really isn't anything. Um, how is Jay's needs? Energy is down a bit. I think we're going to let her sleep. So I guess we might as well just speed through until all the kids get back from school. Oh, I've just realised the teens are probably due home. So are they going to... Oh, yep, here they go. Madeline's brought a friend. Leon did not. They're heading upstairs to get their homework done. So he wants to play a computer game. We'll lock that in. And what does Madeline want to do? Play Marco Polo. I'm not sure it's the right temperature. Oh, Oop, wrong one. Leon, do your homework. Madeline. Gatikalo! Do your homework. Can you slide it out from under your brother's butt? Apparently so. Okay, so after you've finished your homework, you can play... Uh, Command and Conquer. Oh, and then have a shower. 
Madeline, you need the toilet and the shower. And we're going to leave it at that for tasks because I don't want the game to crash. See, they get to finish their homework so quickly. What a relief. Alright, so you fulfilled that aspiration. What else do you want? You want to play Marco Polo. Uh, do you have to? What's the weather? It's winter. You're not playing Marco Polo in winter. Maybe if we had an enclosed pool, that would be possible. But it's outside. You need hygiene. Okay, you fulfilled your wish. Go have a shower. Trent's serving some food. You could probably wake up. Nolan's already up. So come eat that. <clears throat> Nolan's coming to eat. What's the friend's name? Opal. Excuse me, Opal. Oh, how's Parker doing? Oh my gosh. Not too good. Firstly, stop. Oh, Madeline, are you coming to take care of Quinton? Great. Let's change diaper. Get a bottle. Put in crib. <gasps> Ollie's grades are up. Well done, Ollie. Alright, you stop playing with that. And when you finish doing everything you need to, you didn't change the diaper. Or is she stinky? She's not stinky. The baby's stinky. Don't put in crib. Change diaper. Then put in crib. Nikki's falling asleep in mum's bed. Can you come drink this? And then you can go to sleep. Would you? No. Leon, let Parker out. I know, right? Parker. That bottle had better not have gone off. Madeline? Put Parker in the crib? I mean, Quinton in the crib? Come drink this. Go here. Go here. Drink. Mm. Alright, we need to get these kids busy doing something. It's snowing. Leon, you don't really need to do anything. Play a game. No, don't play a game. Go upstairs and play a game. Because we don't want to disturb your sister. Play. Come on and conquer. Madeline. Continue playing games with your friends. Actually, go upstairs and play Don't Wake the Llama. Because we really want to play Don't Wake Your Sister. Or maybe we should do play chess with. No, we can't. Nope, she's going to eat. That's fine. Nikki's had a bottle. I mean, Parker's had the bottle and is off to bed. Nolan's playing games with Madeline. Nikki's still asleep. Where's Jay? Saying well done to your son Ollie for getting good grades. Let's change into every let's change into every day, please. What's going on? Oh, baby passed out. That's fine. 
Uh, hygiene and bladder. Don't wash your hands. Come over here. Use the toilet. Have a shower. Leon's going to be an adult in a few days. Something about Parker. Alright, she wanted a toaster pastry. Her hunger's... She ate the chili con carne. Alright. Ollie's asleep. She's asleep. I'm just going to leave it. I think I'm going to leave it. We're going to end the part here. So we've done pretty well. We're pregnant again with our next baby. This will be R. So we'll have to pick a name. Um, and we need to find a new man. As much as we love Nolan, we do need separate fathers for each child. So we shall have to try to figure that out. Because we can't really leave the house while we're pregnant. Um, and we can't invite people over we haven't met yet. Maybe we'll just have to sit out the front. We'll put a chair out the front and we'll wait for passers-by. <laughs> Alright, so until then, please leave your feedback, comments and suggestions down below. Hit that like button. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time. Oh, 7 o'clock. Calling for Alexis. Bye!